So hi, my name is Pete Shaw. I'm a senior pastor at Crosswalk Community Church in Napa, California, and I'm back with you uh, talking about my, uh, my little bean thing. And the last segment I talked to you about what happened when we fed kids a school lunch every day while they were at Faraha Community Center. But what I want to clue you in on is something that I didn't think about uh, when we started to get involved, and that is that while beans for their tummies was a really good thing, it wasn't the only thing that really mattered. And one of the cool things about Faraha Community Center is it's not just about dietary nutrition, but they look at the whole person. They ask the question, what needs to be in the menu for these kids to have a healthy life? And one of the things they realized was is they needed to have eyes on the home life as well. It wasn't just what was going on at school. So they started a robust social work program where the social workers go into the community to make sure that the home life for the kids uh, is safe and that they have the support that they need. I thought about this in America. If this kind of thing happened in America, parents would get ticked off. We would think this is an intrusion into our privacy, but that's not how it's viewed here uh, because the social workers are seen clearly as a support mechanism uh, for their families. And what are they doing? Well, they're wanting to make sure that if, uh, if they don't have work, that there's food on the table for the kids. They want to make sure that the kids are safe and have clothes that they need. So when you think about the, the comprehensive nature that we're trying to do, we want these kids not to just be fed, uh, we want these kids to thrive. And these kids are not gonna thrive unless their home life is as, as stable as it can be. So that's another thing that I learned about uh, what needs to happen in extreme poverty to make a difference. And I hope that as you're hearing my story and what I've discovered, I hope that you'll get on board with me and my church and start to make a difference too. Thanks for tuning in. We've got one more to go. Uh, to teach you and I hope you'll check that one out as well.